Guys, this um, episode of How to Make Coins in Mutt 17 is going to pretty much revolve around the cover of us sets. Now, I already made uh, a coin making method before on you know, how to get 400k for free by just doing the solos and going and you know just doing um, one set. Now, if you guys want to go check out the video, go check it out. I showed you how to make 400k doing just the solos and one set. So now let's get on to what do you do now? Sell everything, okay? Now, obviously, as you guys know, if you've been watching my videos, you know I always tell you, sell all your elites. Never keep elites. Obviously, all elites are going to do is fall down in price. I can't sell these elite guys, if you're wondering. I can't sell them. I can't. You can't sell Team Heroes. You can't sell a Friday Night Draft player that you get non-auction one tradable. You can't sell them. If you have elites, sell them. Obviously, guys, what you're going to want to do is sell all your bronzes, silvers, and golds. Those cards have gone up in prices, and the reason uh, up in price, and the reason why is because the color rush sets are out, and these color rush sets you need to complete three golds, four silvers, and four bronzes. What does that mean? People want to complete these sets, therefore it's going to cost you a lot. I did complete the 49ers set, and it cost me about 20k to do. Obviously, you can't see that, but because you know it's repeatable sets, but Guys, that's what you're going to want to do. Sell all your 49ers gold. Sell all your silver. Sell all your bronzes. The sets that are going to cost the most, honestly, let's let's, yeah, let's just look through them. Seahawks probably is probably going to be the most expensive. Everyone loves the green uniforms. Steelers, probably expensive, yeah. Texans, I would say yes. Vikings, 100%. Um, Titans, probably not as much. Just because of the fact that the uniforms aren't like too crazy. Uh, definitely the Saints, the Redskins, I don't know, maybe, Ravens, definitely, I could see it. I don't think the Rams, unless, like, guys, I'm talking about fans outside of you, yourself. So, if you love the Rams, obviously Rams fans are going to want to get this uniform. But if you're not a Rams fan, that's what I'm talking about, guys. People, like, I'm a Ravens, Vikings, and Seahawks fan, right? But I would honestly, I would love, I got the 49ers uniforms. I think the 49ers uniforms look one, as one of the best uniforms in this whole color rush program. So that's what I'm talking about, guys. I'm not talking about, you know, if, like, your favorite team. Because you got to look at it as other favorite teams. And how other people are going to want to go out to them. Obviously, I think these look the best other than the Ravens. So obviously, that's why I went with these. But um, definitely the Falcons look awesome. The, um, eh, again, a lot of these kind of look like their normal uniforms, maybe a different shade of the color. That's why also I'm not saying they're not, you know, they all look awesome, all the uniforms, guys, but they're just not as awesome as, you know, I think other uniforms look. But, uh, I definitely love this, even though it's just the same uniforms with a different color, I just love that, like, baby, oh, not baby blue, what is that, dark blue? S something like that. Cardinals always have the best uniforms. Let's be honest. Them and the Jacksonville Jaguars. But, yeah. So, pretty much, guys. The whole point of view is sell all your silver, uh, silvers, bronze, and golds. Golds have gone up a little bit. Silvers, I think, kind of stay the same. And bronzes, going up a little bit, too. So, make sure you sell everything, guys. And just take advantage. And make every coin you can off this promo. As I always say, guys. Make every coin you can off every promo you can. So, obviously... Um, the laundry set is not going to be worth it. Do not do this for Todd Gurley. Just t telling you that now. Like, right now, guys, do not do this for Todd Gurley. It's going to cost you so many coins, so much time, you're not going to make coins back. I guarantee you that. These sets cost you about 20, 30, 40k a piece. These sets cost you 30k a piece, okay? Solos is only going to let you complete five or six of these, uh, challenges. Obviously, um... You know, that's not going to get you enough. And you're going to have to spend 30 k for the rest of the 28 of these. Do not do these, these sets at all. Now, guys, throughout the week, new solos are going to come out. And I think Thursday, if you do all the solos and then Thursday solos, you get a free player, a free Color Rush player. And it's a random player. So, obviously, guys, it's not going to be auctionable tradable. Let's be honest. <laughs> They're not trying to give us a free auctionable tradable Color Rush player. I get it too. It would crash the market. Can you imagine if you could get a free, uh, I don't know, free Color Rush player just for doing solos? And 
it's moment solos too, so it's not like the very difficult solos. Like the solos probably take like five to ten minutes to do. And can you imagine if you got a like, auction but tradable one? I get it. I get why because it would crash the market, but they're not gonna give us auction but tradable. So, but you still get a free player, so not that bad. Anyway, guys, if this video did help you, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel for subscribe to the channel if you're new. And